Yeah. Pick it up, man. It's over a hundred dollars. That is amazing. <laughs> That's like JJ. 175. It still goes for like 10 bucks a pop. Yeah. Like from the bar. What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. We are headed to the North Dallas Toy Show in Plano, Texas. This weekend we got Cincy Nerd with us, we got Rube the Great, we got Boss and Mike, we got Dave from Back Alley Toys. Who else was there? There's so many people there. It was a lot of fun hanging out uh, with the dudes, finding some great deals. So let's not waste any more time and get to the North Dallas Toy Show. That's cool, man. Is that glow in the dark? Yeah, I think so. Radioactive cornholia. Fucking exclusive, dude. Love it. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, street shots. Check out this book. Genetic meltdown. It's pretty clean, man. Oh. Oh. 98. That's cool too, man. That's a great piece. I didn't realize that it was vintage. I wonder how much that is. Got some turtles up here. Oh, random ones, yeah. I'm sure, like these bigger, like muscle men. Uh, Three dollars ninety four. That's not bad. Three dollars ninety four. Not bad. Not terrible. Maybe we can negotiate. The thing that I posted, I was like, I don't know where the hell this thing is from, but it's a fucking kiss thing. Oh yeah. But the crowd threw it with the turtles. I knew it wasn't yeah. a turtle, but I was like, what does that belong to? Psycho Circus. Yeah. What are the odds of rolling into that? That. Room? Oh, got some homies. We gotta buy all the Simpsons before uh, Boston Mike gets out here. Right. Oh, TC. There. Ghostbusters. So over here, yeah. I think that's Vinny, right? Yeah. So. I call them all Vinny, though. They're all Vinny. Yeah, he's Vinny, though. Okay. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> yeah. But I'm looking at that color tomatoes. Hard Oh yeah, you need that. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. Yeah. You don't have this one, right? Well, actually, I have it loose, complete. Do you really? But I'm just curious to yeah. see how much that would be. You have this good deal. Oh, look at that mutant. That's cool. Oh, did I get the realms of the underworld? What do you guys? What do you got on this one? That one. Uh, this one. I have the other one over here. Oh, you got oh, another one. another one. Nice. How much you got on these? I'm asking 60 for both. For oh, both? No, sorry. 60 for each. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was about yeah. to say <laughs> deal. Yeah. Yeah. What do you got on the cornholio beavis and butthead? Uh, that's... And the, uh, <laughs> the I saw you. So I saw you, so I knew it was coming. I wasn't going to be worried about it. Uh, that's the... Um... Yeah. Happy New Year. Yeah, you too. Wow. How you doing? Different card bag. That's a good uh, vehicle down. Oh, there's some turtle shit down there. Mini. Yeah, it's a mini K, but snap a turtle. That's you say vehicle, not a muscle. Uh, what do you want to see this? Yeah. Mikey. It's pretty incomplete. Oh, he's got a the giant storage chest. Box of. That's that's right. Wow, look at that dude. Just the box. What's up, man? Look at that. That's so cool. Sold, but that is amazing. That's so cool. 175. Oh, man. That's a deal. That's Can I have your autograph? Can I have your autograph? Oh, look at that group. great. Got some $2 or $1. Uh, parts. Let's see, too much in here. Oh, TC. How much are those? Dollar. Okay, that's. Is there any more toxic? Mm -hmm. Is there any more toxic? No, 
I'll pick that up for a dollar. That's turtles. We'll take that. Oh, that Crazy is sick. Yeah. That is sick. The still goes for like 10 bucks a pop. Yeah. yeah. Like from the box. That's cool. I've never even seen it. I found this in a, like in the distributor set. So it's still wrapped in the original shrink wrap. Yeah. And it's a three pack. So I got gargoyles, Power Rangers. That's and cool. Looney Tunes. Oh, that's sweet. Check these out. Got some good ones. Rarely find this guy completes. That guy completes. What do we got on here? Two seventy-five. Oh, here, that's nice. That is heat. That's some heat. There it is, right here. Isn't it amazing how the boxes still people have them? Like, look how good that is. Nice. Trapped in Skull Mountain. What's the heavy hitter one here? The most. Maybe Ar Arctic that one, or probably yeah, the frontier. The over there, How much is he? This one's two seventy-five. Uh, how much that one? Pick it up. It should be on. The I ain't picking it up, man. It's over a hundred dollars. It's on his butt. One fifty. One fifty. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. Found this. <gasps> no case. Muppet Show. Muppet Show. Yes. To Ruby. Yep. I actually nice. bought something here. The uh, mutation. Okay. The here. I've never seen that before. Yeah. You haven't? Yeah, no. Marks. And I work in a toy store. No, no. That collector case is nice. Pretty nice. Pretty clean. Pretty clean. You got super shred. It's turn yellow. It's actually really, really clean. clean. You got these out here. Yeah, that's right. Alright, so these are 5 for 20. And then here. You got a rocker turtle. You got. Let's see if there's anything. What's that? Where's he from? Um. Uh, it looks like the guy that was I in the uh, Matrix. Yeah. Anyway, let's see what else is in this box for five for twenty. Let's see if there's anything good. Uh. So I think I'm just gonna pick up Rocker Leo for uh, five bucks. I think it's a good deal. Being, being Mike. <laughs> Dang it, Mike. Well, hey. I didn't put a toy. I didn't put a toy back where he yelled at me, so I had to fix it. You had to fix it. Yeah. What is this, dude? Like they came in, in, in and all that. That's uh, Ski Lord from uh, Power Rangers. His name's Ski Lord. <laughs> just that part. All right. What so I'm gonna do is Lucy's. There's a, another rocker. Not another rocker. Yeah, but a rocker. Yeah. And what do we got over here? Oh, Triclops. Got one on the side. Next mutation is Leo. Got a Super Shred. What else do we got? Single axle. And. You know, I can do all the work. All right, so this one's 25, and this is actually the uh, vintage re-release, all complete with the yellow weapons. So I'm definitely gonna pick that up. Good deal. My first pickup of the day was this Rocker Leo Team and T Turtle from 1991. He was loose, as you can see, and I got him in that bin for. Five dollars. It was definitely a turtle day, so I went ahead and got Punker Don. He was also five dollars. So shout out to Randy. Uh, thanks a lot, man, for hooking me up. Five bucks. I went back to that booth where I picked up that Rocker Leo because I saw this Donatello here, and something about him was just a little different because he had all of these yellow accessories. And if you remember, um, this movie too, Don did not come with yellow accessories. So I reached out to Turtle Chris and he was like, yeah, dude, that's a vintage re-release. And with the yellow weapons, this is a pretty hard to come by uh, turtle with all of his weapons, just because of the re-release, there wasn't I guess that many made with these colors for their accessories. So I went back and I got it for $25, which is great because 
like I said, I, I didn't know that this was a thing. I didn't know Movie 2 Turtles came with different colored weapons. So 25 bucks for a complete, um, I guess, variant, we could call it. Movie 2, Don. Heck of a deal. So that is all my pickups from the North Dallas Toy Show. I do, however, have some gifts that people gave me while I was at the show and after the show. So let's get into that right quick. First of all, my buddy Dave Back Alley Toys, the director of Retro Freaks, he knows that I've been picking up Creature of the Black Lagoon uh, merch. So he gifted me this creature by Nanco. So my creature shelf is right there behind him. He's gonna look perfect up in there with him. He also gifted me this uh, card or sticker, Revenge of the Creature, right there. And then that's what the other side looks like. So this is really cool. That's gonna look very good displayed. And then last but not least, this is one of those, I believe it's Burger King toys that uh, the Burger King kids mill came with this guy, but somebody put a, um, like a keychain into his head, but he's still, he's translucent and he's freaking creatures. So Dave, thank you so much, buddy. And then we ran into my buddy Eris from Variant Comics, so check them out on the YouTube. If you're into comic books, like, he's the resource. You really need to follow him. But he was set up there, and this is his book that he did. It's called Astonishing Times. Um, what's really cool, he was pointing out, he's like, freaking Scott Snyder read his book and did a little, little, some verbiage for him, like, shouted him out, talked about how great the book was and everything so i cannot wait to read this so eris thank you so much buddy for gifting me this remember uh if you're into comics definitely check out variant comics on the youtube and follow them because they put out mwah, great content and then last but not least uh boss and mike gave me uh some Christmas presents that I, I was not expecting and he freaking nailed it. So first of all, he got me this vintage Masters of the Universe. Uh, this is Orko. This is uh, one of those hangers that goes on the wall. So I already have He-Man. I need to get Skeletor. And then he also got me the Man at Arms one right there. So now I'm gonna be on the lookout to get Skeletor so I can get, uh, I guess all of these, I, I'm not too sure how many of these they made, but definitely gotta get Skeletor. So Mike, thank you so much, buddy. And then Mike didn't stop there. No, sir. No, he did not. He knew that for years I've been after this piece right here. And this is Nintendo Power number one. It has all the poster, or the, it has the Zelda poster inside of it. It has the registration card. And this is in super, super good condition. I passed on a copy of Nintendo Power, I think it was three or four years ago at Retro Palooza, and it was a stupid good price, and I since then been regretting it, but Mike took it up. I used to carry this magazine, not this one, but Nintendo Power number one in my binder, bring it to school, and I used to read through this all the time during school, getting my cheat code game up and just, you know, going into a different world, which I should have been paying attention to school, but I love video games. See, I love freaking Nintendo. So Mike, dude, this means a lot. Thank you so much. I'm going to get a nice little shadow box for this and hang it up real nice real nice guys that will do it for this video make sure you like the video subscribe if you haven't and if you're in the dfw area you should check out the north dallas toy show great vendors uh it's only three dollars to get in it's the first saturday of each month so check them out uh had a great time hanging out with the boys so boys thank you so much good times and until next time woo!